Imagine a world before dinosaurs, a time when giant reptiles ruled the supercontinent of Pangaea. This was the late Permian period, roughly 260 million years ago. The Earth was a vastly different place with unique landscapes and climates that shaped the evolution of life in extraordinary ways. Among the strange and wonderful creatures of this era lived a formidable predator, Enostran Savia. This creature was a marvel of prehistoric evolution, showcasing the diversity and complexity of life forms that existed long before the age of dinosaurs. This massive beast was not a dinosaur but a type of prehistoric reptile known as a Gorgonopsid. Gorgonopsids were a group of therapsids often referred to as mammal-like reptiles, which dominated the late Permian ecosystems. Inostrancevia was a fierce hunter, equipped with powerful jaws and sharp teeth designed to take down large prey. Its discovery has provided crucial insights into the ecosystems of this distant past, revealing the intricate web of life that existed millions of years ago. Enostrancevia lived millions of years before the first dinosaurs walked the Earth. This period was marked by significant evolutionary advancements, setting the stage for the rise of future dominant species. They were part of a group called synapsids, which are actually more closely related to mammals than to dinosaurs. Synapsids include the ancestors of all modern mammals, making Inostrancevia a distant relative of creatures like us. Inostrancevia was one of the largest predators of its time, and its fossils tell a fascinating story of life on Earth before the dinosaurs. These fossils, carefully studied by paleontologists, offer a window into a world that was both alien and familiar, a testament to the enduring legacy of life on our planet. The work of uncovering and studying these ancient creatures is painstaking and meticulous. Each fossil fragment adds a piece to the puzzle, helping scientists reconstruct the lives and environments of these long-extinct animals. As we journey through time from the Permian to the present day, we gain a deeper appreciation for the resilience and adaptability of life. Inostrancevia with its fearsome presence is a reminder of the ever-changing nature of our planet and the incredible diversity of life it has supported. While Inostrancevia and its kin are long gone, their legacy lives on in the form of modern predators. The evolutionary lineage that began with these ancient hunters continues to shape the natural world we see today. Museums around the world showcase the fossils of Inostrancevia, allowing us to connect with a distant past. These exhibits not only educate but also inspire awe and wonder at the incredible history of life on Earth. As the sun sets over the ancient landscapes of our imagination, we are reminded of the fleeting nature of existence and the enduring impact of those who came before us. Inostrancevia, a predator from a forgotten era, continues to captivate our minds and fuel our curiosity about the mysteries of the past. Enostrancevia was a truly imposing creature. This prehistoric predator roamed the Earth millions of years ago, and its physical characteristics were nothing short of awe-inspiring. Imagine a reptile larger than a tiger, with a thick powerful body and a massive head. Its sheer size and strength would have made it a dominant force in its ecosystem. Some scientists believe that Enostrancevia was covered in scales, similar to modern-day reptiles, while others suggest it may have had a smooth, hairless skin. This debate continues as new fossil evidence is discovered and analyzed. Regardless of its skin texture, this predator was a sight to behold. Its presence alone would have been enough to strike fear into the hearts of other creatures. The most striking feature of Enostrancevia was its skull. This massive structure was not only large, but also intricately designed for its predatory lifestyle. It could grow over two feet long, armed with a set of terrifying teeth. These teeth were not just for show, they were highly functional and specialized. Unlike the teeth of many reptiles, which are all roughly the same shape, Enostrancevia had differentiated teeth. This unique feature set it apart from many other prehistoric predators. This meant it possessed different types of teeth for different purposes, much like mammals do today. This adaptation would have given it a significant advantage in hunting and consuming a variety of prey. It had large, saber-like canines for piercing flesh and shearing through bone. These formidable teeth were perfect for taking down large prey and ensuring a successful kill. In addition to its saber-like canines, Enostrancevia also had smaller teeth for tearing and grinding. These teeth allowed it to process its food more efficiently, breaking down tough meat and bones. The jaw structure of Enostrancevia was equally impressive. Its powerful jaws could exert tremendous force, making it capable of crushing bones and tearing through the toughest hides. 
When you imagine Inostrancevia in action, it's easy to see why it was such a formidable predator. Its physical characteristics were perfectly suited for a life of hunting and survival in a harsh prehistoric world. The fossilized remains of Inostrancevia continue to provide valuable insights into its anatomy and lifestyle. Each new discovery helps paleontologists piece together the puzzle of this incredible creature's existence. As we learn more about Inostrancevia, we gain a deeper appreciation for the diversity and complexity of life that once thrived on our planet. This prehistoric predator remains a fascinating subject of study and a testament to the wonders of evolution. Inostrancevia was the apex predator of its environment, meaning it sat atop the food chain. Its size, speed, and powerful bite meant few creatures could stand against it. This formidable predator likely hunted large herbivores, using its keen senses to track and ambush its prey. We can imagine Inostrancevia using its powerful limbs to chase down its prey, delivering a fatal blow with its saber-like teeth. Its reign of terror would have shaped the behavior of other animals in its ecosystem as prey animals evolved ways to avoid this fearsome predator. Fossils of Inostrancevia have been found primarily in what is now Russia, in a region known for its Permian-era river deposits. This suggests that Inostrancevia was likely adapted to a life around bodies of water, much like modern-day crocodiles. It is possible that Inostrancevia used these rivers to its advantage when hunting, ambushing thirsty prey that came to the water's edge for a drink. The rivers may have also provided a convenient way for Inostrancevia to travel throughout its territory. Section 5. A Family of Killers. Different Species of Inostrancevia. Several species of Inostrancevia have been identified, each with its own unique characteristics. One of the largest and best-known species is Inostrancevia alexandri, named after the Russian paleontologist who first described it, Anatoly Nikolaevich Ryabinin. Another intriguing species is Inostrancevia latifrons, which had a broader skull than other species. These different species likely occupied slightly different ecological niches, with some specializing in certain types of prey or hunting grounds. Section 6. Inostrancevia's World – A Glimpse into the Late Permian the Late Permian was a time of incredible biodiversity, with a wide array of reptiles, amphibians, and early synapsids inhabiting the supercontinent of Pangaea. Inostrancevia shared its world with creatures like the sail-backed Dimetrodon, the burrowing Lystrosaurus, and the massive herbivore Scutosaurus. By studying the fossils of Inostrancevia and its contemporaries, scientists can piece together a picture of this ancient ecosystem. We can learn about the food webs, the predator-prey relationships, and the environmental conditions that shaped life during this time. Section 7. The Extinction, a Mystery Unsolved. The reign of Inostrancevia, like that of all the incredible creatures of the Permian, eventually came to an end. These formidable predators, with their saber-like teeth and powerful limbs, once roamed the ancient landscapes dominating their ecosystems. The Permian-Triassic extinction event, also known as the Great Dying, wiped out over 90% of marine species. This event was the most severe extinction event in Earth's history, far surpassing the more famous extinction that ended the reign of the dinosaurs and 70% of terrestrial vertebrate species on Earth. The loss of such a vast number of species reshaped the biological landscape, leading to a dramatic shift in the planet's biodiversity. This catastrophic event marked the end of the Permian period and ushered in the age of the dinosaurs. The once thriving ecosystems were left barren and lifeless, a stark contrast to the vibrant world that existed before. The exact causes of the Permian-Triassic extinction are still debated by scientists. Researchers have spent decades piecing together clues from the geological record, trying to understand the sequence of events that led to such widespread devastation. But it was likely a combination of factors, including massive volcanic eruptions, climate change, and ocean acidification. The volcanic activity would have released vast amounts of greenhouse gases, leading to a runaway greenhouse effect and severe global warming. Whatever the cause, the world of Inostrancevia and its contemporaries vanished, paving the way for a new era in Earth's history. The extinction event cleared the stage for the rise of the dinosaurs, who would go on to dominate the planet for the next 160 million years, evolving into some of the most iconic creatures ever to walk the Earth. Section 8. A Legacy in Stone. The Importance of Inostrancevia's Discovery. 
The discovery of Inostrensavia fossils has been invaluable to our understanding of prehistoric life. These fossils provide a window into a time long before the dinosaurs, when mammal-like reptiles ruled the Earth. By studying Inostrensavia, we gain a deeper appreciation for the diversity of life that has existed on our planet and the forces that have shaped its evolution. Each new fossil discovery adds another piece to the puzzle, helping us to paint a more complete picture of our planet's fascinating past.